for free. Download. 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 Friday. Trantendo. What is going on, guys? DJ F here. Free download Friday. Smash that like button because I know you I love, love it. Love. And <laughs> what we have in front of us is isotope ozone imager the link will be in the description box as i had just got this email and i was very happy about it that it's going to be a free download because this is a very useful tool for those who are trying to mix and master and i will show you how and why but for those who have not seen the vlog you can see clearly like it's out of like it is stereo separated right around here and that has to be taken care of so, you know, I'm just making sure that, you know, it's not as much phasing right there. As you see, if it drops to like zero, that means that in a mono field, it will not sound great. Like uh, my first vlog, I spoke on that and why I use the imager. So anyways here, um, please uh, follow the directions on here and, you know, give me a shout out because, you know, I'm trying to check out other stuff from Isotope and this would help the channel here. Uh, being able to win this contest and you know if I don't win the contest hey I will still continue to lay that free download Friday stuff on you so we already have it pulled up in the DAW which is Ableton Live I know you guys are not gonna be happy about that but hey and let's see how it do also if you just need um instructions on how to install or whatnot it, it provides it for you and i'll provide a link on how to install vsts for those who don't know how to anywho okay so what does the example sound like i'm going to turn it down and we're going to go to the push cam bazao and we're going to press play this is from the vlog the second vlog video So, you know, I assembled a record or whatnot, and I just put the imager on my, uh, what track is this? <laughs> track number five. <laughs> and, you know, as you can see right here, this is a straight line. So that means that it is extremely mono. Um, you know, it's good for telling whatever, you know, is uh, in stereo or what's in mono. So uh, you kind of want your, your palette to sound a specific way if you're gonna use this. So I'm gonna bring in other elements to this track here. And I'm gonna go and I go to my session here and I'm gonna press this. Okay, so now I'm gonna pull in the ozone imager right here. And okay. Whoopsies. And where we have here, we're gonna look at this in particular. Uh, Basically, what you want this to be at, it's in between one and zero. If it's all the way to zero, that means there's a lot of stereo separation in that track. And I'm sure if I was in, to introduce like the 808 bass and the hi-hats, other stuff would happen. All right, so I'm gonna go back to the master track here. And, oops, I don't think I did put it in there. And now we're back to the pol uh, polar level. As you can see, it's just like, it's pretty dead center. So it's not really all that crazy as far as like uh, the different uh, separation here and up uh, so bypass it. So you can, uh, you can bypass it or whatnot. Um, if I'm not mistaken, you can mess with like the whiff. good for gauging like your mixes and stuff like that so I mean that's basically about it there you know it's just a, it's a pretty good tool um, if for those who want a little bit more on that again uh, that video would uh, shed some light on that uh, uh, in particular you know I'm gonna type in ozone there we're gonna pull up ozone 7 here 
And Ozo 8 is on the way, too. I just heard about that, and that's kind of crazy. Nope. But uh, it's it's a pretty cool tool. It comes pretty much uh, with, with every standard version of uh, Ozone 7. It also comes as a separate uh, uh, VST. But that is one of the things. That's actually one of the main reasons why I, I kind of adopted uh, Ableton as my main DAW is the, the strong signal path that it has. Of course, you know, if I wanted to stereo separate stuff, you know, I could do that in different tracks. But uh, it's true mono, basically, per track or whatnot. Not in the master itself. As you can see, it's a stereo, it's just a stereo image. It's just that it's very straightforward and, and not leaning everywhere. But anyways, I am TJ Av, guys. And, yeah, a lot of rambling. Not, not needed either. But thank you, guys. Make sure you check out my vlogs and stuff like that. And, yeah. Later, guys. Crab Tendo.